And now, an all-new character fantasy. Have you ever wanted to be someone else? I'm Jeannie Mai, and this is Character Fantasy. Have you ever dreamed of premiering your own clothing line at a real live fashion show? Well, then you've got to meet Gracie, a super cool student with a secret character fantasy. I want to be a fashion designer. <laughs> Ever since I was little, I was always designing clothes for my Barbie dolls. <laughs> They'd come with the dresses and I'd throw them away and I'd cut my own out of construction paper. Today we're hooking Gracie up with fashion design lessons, having her create and construct her very own killer outfit, then giving her a chance to debut her piece at a real life fashion show. Hope you're ready to make it work, Gracie, because Character Fantasy is on its way, girl. Hi, Gracie. I'm Jeannie from Character Fantasy. Oh my god! How you doing? Hi. I heard you wanted to become a fashion designer. Yes. All right, I'm here to make that happen, so you gotta come with me. Gracie's first in fulfilling her fantasy, fashion design lessons from renowned eco-friendly designer Deborah Lindquist. Gracie, this is Deborah Lindquist. She is a couture-inspired green designer. So you guys get to it. I'm sure you have a lot to show her, and I'll be back. Sure. All right. In terms of being a fashion designer, there are three really important things. One being you are creating something that really inspires you. Mm -hmm. Second of all, what you're making is something that you actually could wear. And thirdly, it really needs to be made well. I have no idea what today brings, but I'm so excited. Do you think Gracie has the vision and the time to create her own signature piece? Find out when Character Fantasy returns. Welcome back to Character Fantasy, where this week's character, Gracie, is learning how to design clothes from eco-friendly fashion designer, Deborah Lindquist. Why don't you help us explain exactly what a green designer does? My philosophy is really to do something good for the planet. I make clothing out of a combination of recycled materials and some new eco-fabrics. Um, it can be grown without the use of pesticides. So are you limited to hemp? I use also organic cotton, recycled materials like cashmere, or recycled wool. I use a little bit of soy and bamboo. Those are synthetic forms of natural products. I really haven't ever heard of a designer helping the environment. This is yeah. done with hemp silk. Yeah. That's cool. The first piece I ever made, it was old jeans I made into a purse. What even inspired you to come up with the concept of being environmentally aware when you're designing? Well, I think it's helping to save the environment, and I guess I'll just do it one sweater at a time. You have a lot of inspiration. I know. Go off of here, so you guys get to work. When Character Fantasy returns, Gracie starts designing her very first eco-friendly outfit for a surprise event. Don't go away. Welcome back to Character Fantasy, where this week's character, Gracie, just got fashion design lessons from eco-friendly designer, Deborah Lindquist. We're gonna create a sweater, something that's very personal to her. What kind of symbols do you like? I would like to do the Florida de Lee, which is a symbol of New Orleans. Oh, okay. I grew up in New Orleans, Louisiana. When Katrina hit New Orleans, it was just gone. It was horrible. This is not really symmetrical here. <laughs> yeah. The first Florida de Lee I made wasn't really symmetric. You could fold this in half and okay. just make a cut there. Once I got the hang of it, it started looking better. What up to right now? Well, I'm sketching a Florida de Lee right now. Just gotta cut it out. Well, I have something to tell you. Tonight, you are going to be showcasing your own signature piece in Deborah's fashion show. No way. Yeah. Oh my god. A lot of pressure now. A yeah. lot of pressure because fashion designers are always just short on time, so you better get to it. Yeah, I do. <laughs> when Jeannie told me that my sweater will be on the runway, I was so excited. Sewing at first. <laughs> I pushed down on the accelerator really fast. And it was just like taking the material away. And then I got help from a really sweet lady who works for Deborah. Oh my gosh. This turned out. Rad! Okay, we have a show to rock, so we'll see you on the runway. When Character Fantasy returns, Gracie's new outfit debuts at a real live fashion show. Welcome back to Character Fantasy, where this week's character, Gracie, has gotten fashion design lessons from renowned, equal friendly designer, Deborah Lindquist. She's designed a killer outfit and is now ready to debut it at a real live fashion show. Hey, how are you guys doing tonight? Woo! All right, you are here for the official premiere of Deborah Lindquist fall line and with a special feature of Miss Gracie Guevara right over here. Let's roll. When I saw the model walking up there, I was like, oh, I designed that. To actually have somebody model something I designed, I felt really special. <laughs> 
just the best day ever. <laughs> now that, you guys, was an environmentally friendly, stylistic success. To make yours come true, check out characterfantasy.com.